uh, 3.6 um, as you can see okay so I'm gonna show you guys here what you guys need to do you guys don't need to do what the other video said unless you just feel like doing it that way that's fine you know you want to take out the engine mount you want to replace it then do it that way if you don't need to replace the engine mount this is what you do okay so i'm gonna get back up under here one second hold on folks okay so you see that's the engine mount right okay so the starter goes up Let's see if i can get this for you guys okay so start goes up face in okay and this is the old one i'm just doing this as an example so Okay, so I think that's how I got it out. Okay, I went back end up. Sorry, back end up. All right. Move this bracket just a little bit where you can get okay. There you go. Alright, let's see how I fucking twist oh shit. Alright, do this one more time. Alright, so it's in there, look. Okay. The cone of it is over there, but if it's over there, right? So you twist it to the right, and then, and then twist up, okay? And then you move this over just a little bit more, okay? And bam, it's in there. Your wires are up here. There's a little connector on your wire. See the connector? That one goes on the back end over here, or the solenoid, and then your actual wire is stuck over behind here. Okay? It's a little tip, man. So all you do is you loosen this one, okay? There's a shorty, okay? That goes right here, okay? There's a long one right here, okay? That's the long one. These are all 15 mil. They're fun, okay? Then there's one short one right here, one short one right here. Make sure you loosen those. That way this bracket can move a little bit, you know? Um, and then loosen, where is it? Right here, there's a bolt that goes in here. And there's a nut. I don't know if you could see it. Um, let see if I can get the camera closer. All right, see that right there? Uh, let's see. Right there, okay? There's a, a nut that goes on there. Uh, okay, I'm moving the, the air conditioning. Um, uh, I think it's a return hose or some shit like that. Anyways, um, I'm tired. <laughs> been at it for about two hours but it's a lot better than fucking four hours at a dealership sitting there waiting for them to give you a bill of 600 bucks you know save yourself some time and some money but and then there's another shorty bolt that goes up here it's on the top side of this long bolt okay um and then there's another one right here okay and those look like this okay that's that that bolt for the air conditioner line okay um there's the nut right here okay those are 13 or half inch and then 
these are the little short 15s that go on top right here this one this one will go on this one right here okay on this side okay and then this the other longer one right here this longer one right here will go on this side over here okay on the top side the the short one goes these ones are almost identical okay so you can't really get these mixed up it's that one and the top one are these ones okay and then the green one is for the fronts of your vehicle but on the top side and then there's the long one that goes right underneath that all right so that's on a 2011 lorado jeep grand cherokee uh with the 3.6 i'm gonna get this starter out and put a new one in folks thank you for watching have a great day